Hello, friends and fans! We're back to Rogue Tower! Hello, Andis! What's going on? Alright, I installed some mods, so this will be a lot faster. Because we can speed up the speed. Yes, I figured I would jump into this for a bit, because I wasn't able to put out a Timberborn video today. <laughs> <laughs> but I will tomorrow. But until then, let's do some towering, huh? Ah, the music's so much shorter now because it doesn't last as long. <laughs> How are you guys doing? The challenge we're going for is ballistas only. I tried it before and I failed miserably. <laughs> we shall see. Okay, just keep taking upgrades to Ballista. Just everything. Everything for Ballista. The idea that I have is to set up, like, separate Ballista areas, each one dealing with shields or something else. And that might work. They also, eventually, the Ballistas get, like... Bleed and fire and burn poison upgrades and everything. So through the use of that, we might be able to manage this. Especially since this is turning around. That's pretty good. Definitely good. Uh, yeah. Great. Okay. <laughs> oh, we're, we're already out of money. <clears throat> I tried it once before to record a video to do this and uh, I made it I made it like to like level 30 or 40 something I mean I know it can be done see like right here look ballistas deal uh, bleed damage so it's already starting to do that so that's good this is gonna be nice this little hill okay there we go, banditry. That's what we needed. This is curving around really nicely. And more banditry. Ooh, although we can get bleed now. Or do we have... No, we have bleed already. We have burn. We could do burn. No. Banditry is always the way to go. Need the money. Right? Yeah, I mean, this is curving. Like, I... Yeah. <laughs> this, these curves are beautiful. I haven't had one curve like this in a long time. At least we're getting good upgrades. Right, exactly. The only downside to banditry is that if they ever get to the tower, they deal, like, way more damage. Because they're only supposed to deal one damage each. But <laughs> for every level of banditry you take, it deals more and more damage. Right, I'm still trying to figure out... I mean, I guess we should take over this. This whole hilly area is pretty, pretty, pretty clutch. So maybe we'll sell some of these towers. Okay, Lifesteal. This is the only downside, because now I'm getting stuff that I don't really care about. Because we, keep, we, don't, we can't use the towers. No. No, no, the challenge is no. Oh, I mean, to take a tower? Yeah, I guess so. I mean, if you get, like, six towers as your cards, then I guess you would have to take a... Yeah. But uh, that, ideally, you don't want to. But we can still do, like, burn upgrades and stuff. Those are useful. Or lifesteal. We'll take lifesteal. You just... I mean, you just can't place it. As long as you don't place it, I think you're fine. Because the achievement just says you survive without building any towers. So I, th I think that's all you gotta do. All right, we're going to make, we'll just make a nice killing field right here for now. 
and see where this curves. I've tr I tried this two times and made it to like level 30-ish, like late 30s. And I, I think I know where I made mistakes. But I, I didn't have to take any towers at that point. The Ballista doesn't cost mana, but there is an, uh, an upgrade that you can take that lets them use mana to deal more damage. So mana will be nice eventually if we get that card, which we haven't yet. More Banditry. What's up, Sacken? I think Banditry, although Burn would be really nice. Because armor is going to be an issue pretty soon. We're going we're gonna to st st still go for Banditry. Still money. Because the, the towers just get more and more expensive with each one. If we could get the life, or I mean the, the mana thing right now, that would be really good. But I haven't seen it come up. I think I'm just going to keep stacking. No, I mean, I should spread it out. Just go like that. The problem comes in because the, the, they're all the ballistas are single, single target. So when you get to the things that spawn stuff constantly, like it's, that's where it's like really hard because they just don't fire fast enough. My best run, I had them getting like an insane amount of burn, bleed, and poison, and slow, and everything. And even then, it still gets kind of rough. But I mean, it's got to be doable. <laughs> All right, we're going to do more burn damage, or just burn damage, period. So that's good. Maybe this is where... This is already a pretty long run. Because at some point, I we need to establish like an armor murdering section... And then... Yeah, I mean, I, I could... I No, I didn't do that. But that would mean, like, resetting it and then playing a bunch to get those upgrades all over again. So it would just be frustrating, I guess. But that would be, the idea, like, the most perfect way to do it. Yeah, I did not do that. But the upgrades from the other stuff isn't going to pop up unless you take those towers. So, so long as we manage to avoid taking those towers, then we won't have to worry about those extra cards showing up. They pay, I mean, yeah, I guess. I mean, we could, we could place it like there and there. It's just, I don't really find the houses to be given that much. Like, these towers are more worthwhile to be other places. Yeah, so towers upgrade based upon what they hit. So, let's, what do we... Oh, we got slow or bleed. I guess we'll go for slow. Slow will be good. Um, yeah, so you can see, like, here, like, this tower's done damage to armor and to health. And so the meter fills up. So when, when it levels up, if I'm not the one paying for it, if it levels up automatically, it'll level up according to what, which bar hit there first. And then this bar will go down. So like if, like, let's say this leveled up. So now that bar went down because it needs more to upgrade. So, yes. So depending on what they hit. So eventually, I think my, what I did last time, was I made a section do shields, and all the towers did shields only, so they would attack everyone with shields, and then I had a secondary section that just did armor, and then the rest of the towers just did health. So in theory, if you wipe shields first, because they come first, and then armor from the next tower, and then health, then you should be kind of okay. As far as the houses, the houses just don't bring in that much money, in my experience. I mean, they're okay, but it's like, th this one's going to bring in 30 gold. That's not a lot. Whereas we could put these towers somewhere else and be more useful. But I, I mean, I still stick them there in the early game just because, I don't know, because it's there. And I should, I guess. <laughs> but eventually I'll probably sell those towers. Ooh, it's Oogie. We got our first boss. All right, after this, it's going to be armor time. Right, so... The priority, right, so the, the focus, I think, is you have to prioritize with, with this run, with the Ballista run. We are not... What's happening here? <laughs> are they? I just don't really notice them bringing that much in, but I mean, I still have them 
around. See, Uki's got look at look at all that burn. He's got two thousand of each. That was easy, easy. Ballista fifteen percent crit chance. Ooh, that's nice. Okay. Okay. And more slow. Okay, this is this is working out pretty good. I have most of the houses covered. I don't know. Eventually, you're getting so much money from banditry that it almost doesn't matter. All right, where do we set up our armor murder field? <laughs> do we do it here? Or maybe, like, over here? Because we still need a bit of a long run to handle everything else. This does look good. I wonder if this is going to turn. If that turns, that would be nice. These are all threes. All right, we're going to stick some towers up here and see... All right, that doesn't go anywhere. I guess I should already be focusing on armor. Oh, and they have shields too? Oh man, I should have been already doing this. <laughs> More of a make mistake. <laughs> That's alright, I think we'll be able to deal with this wave. The next one is we'll have to worry about. I just kind of wanted to spread out the line first. Alright, alright, that's okay. We'll give them more burn. It's also the only thing that's worthwhile on there. Alright, so they have shields now. Did you? It's, it's addicting, man. Like, hours go by. I would strongly advise installing the speed mod. Because otherwise it's... I mean, oh, I don't know. I mean, it's fine on normal, too. It's fun to watch the chaos. Alright, this is going to be our shield killing field. So, most shield. And then this might be armor. So, like, these tiles will be shield. These tiles will be armor. So, that might work. Let's drop a couple more. Most shield. These can be most armor. Does that make sense? I think that makes sense. The game's also like real brutal, Bacon, because uh, when you first start out, like you have very few cards and like you only get them like every four turns or something ridiculous. It's just, I don't know. The upgrade path is silly, I think. All right, these are all going to be most armor, right? Most armor, most armor, okay. And these are shields, so we'll drop a few more. Oh, we don't have money. Damn it, I wanted to upgrade these. Okay, here, let's get a couple upgrades for shields. All right, that's all we got. Have you done any of the challenges, Sakin? Ah, uh, they don't have enough strength. They're too weak. It's alright. I think we have enough towers overall. I gotta move some of these. Yeah, it's the shield guys that's the problem right now. Three percent chance to freeze enemies. That's kind of cool. How does that work? Yeah, yeah. The shields are just like blowing straight through. 
God, I can't afford any more towers. We've got to start upgrading them. I think that's the answer. So we're going to get rid of these towers. Because they're not serving, serving both ways anyway. That might be a mistake, but maybe not. <laughs> and we're going to do... We're going to upgrade these to, like, level 10. For shields. Okay. The hell's Granny Simulator? Like, Grandma Simulator? <laughs> Most shield... All right, that should give us some shield punch over here. Maybe we'll do... Are they not targeting... They probably are. They gotta be targeting shielded people. All right. All right, here come the shield guys. We'll slow it down just to make sure. Yeah, there you go. See, they're hitting them, like, real hard now. And they're slowing them a lot more because they're dealing so much more damage. Now their shields aren't getting through. Okay. Next, we got to worry about armor. Armor's being taken care of by these towers, even though we didn't upgrade them. How's my volume relative to the game music, by the way? Should I turn the game up or turn it down? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. What an upgrade. Look at that. Nothing's getting through now. Yeah, I guess not, huh? That's weird. But whatever. <laughs> I'm not going to complain about it. The game that I won, the the, stu the the path went like... I don't even know how many tiles. Like my last video that I uploaded, it was a lot. That was pretty good, too. I imagine it'll split soon. Uh, okay, so we handled we handled the shield guys. The shield guys are, are okay over here. So we should really upgrade armor towers over here. Give them some more armor. Armor oomph. I think I'm going to take them all up to level 10. And then we'll start placing more towers. Okay. That was all our money, too, so. <laughs> the problem with these towers is that they're also starting to level into other stuff. So we might need to pump more money into them. I just, I think that's the mistake that I made. Last time I pumped too much money into too few towers and didn't split it up enough. I mean, they're handling the shield guys really well. That's that's the main concern. I always find shields to be the problem in this game. Okay. So like, this is fairly useless. I guess we could do more bleed or faster bleed. I always say more bleed. But really, it's faster bleed. Well, there's a split. <laughs> so that means we can still utilize this area. We can do this whole front area of shields. Might be excessive, but I don't know. Oh, we got the fast shielded guys now. See, it's deceptive, because this this is what happened last time, because it was working, like, real well, and then all of a sudden things just started getting through. So I don't know. I don't know what to do there. <laughs> you know? Like, once everything starts falling apart, how do you handle it? Let's do... I'm going to spread them out more so they're slowing for longer. And these are still going to be shields. I think that's the way to go. 
In theory, the way to do this challenge is to find out how other people did it, but that's no fun. <laughs> I'd rather just suffer. Suffer myself, you know? So these are 10, 10. These are all 10. These two are not. Yeah, see, these towers are already upgraded into health a couple of times. But, whatever. We'll survive. More splits. There, there they go. I gotta slow it down to see what's happening. If you guys got advice or opinions, let me know. <laughs> They're all getting slowed nice. Pretty much, well... No, but they'll be fine once they get to the armor one. Heavy shaft. <laughs> Everyone likes a heavy shaft. You know? I guess I should have upgraded some towers. But we'll see we'll see how this goes without an upgrade. Maybe that's the challenge. Poison? I haven't gotten the card yet for poison. We're doing uh we're doing ballista only, so I'm waiting. I'm I'm, I'm I I would really love a poison card. <laughs> I mean, they're managing pretty well. We still have this whole, like, tail-end ass for them to go through. Oh, there you go. Poison bolts. See, you gotta ask really nicely. <laughs> I guess we'll go this. Hopefully this turns to the right. That would be amazing. And it doesn't. <laughs> of course. Alright, we should definitely do... I don't know. What should we do? I'll do some health upgrades over here. Just in case. Yeah, see, now they got poison stacks, so their, uh, their shields are going to get burned away before they even get anywhere. I'd like to start getting the poison slow and the fire crit and health damage and all that stuff. That stuff would be nice. Okay. We're managing. So far, we're managing. Uh, more shield damage. It's pretty basic, but whatever. I'm trying to figure out what the problem is right now. See, the problem is there is no problem. Like, it all feels good, and then, and then things start falling apart. It just depends. I mean, it depends what's better. If, like, certain t if a tower's an AoE tower, then pumping upgrades into it is, like, really, really strong because it hits everything. I don't really know if Ballista means no, uh, no, no university or siphon or something. That, I don't think that'd be possible. You can give hints if you want. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. Sure. I mean, you can't do more Ballistas in the middle. Like here? Yeah, I mean, that's that's our, like our back line. I guess I should just have more in general, just in case. I think for the Ballista challenge specifically, you need more. More is better because of the upgrades. The way the upgrades work is that they just multiply all the damage anyway. So having more is nice. I guess that's a pretty good spot. If it can hit both sides, I feel like that's that's a, that's a money slot. <laughs> How's that? Because by the end, we the, the health, armor, and shield multipliers are so high because we're only taking those cards. I think you're allowed banks and stuff. I would imagine the achievement... Because you can't... It, there's a card to do mana. Like, to, to use mana for the Ballista. So it wouldn't make sense to not be... To not... 
university i you know honestly i i've i don't get the university i'm not sure how it works i've tried using it and every time i get confused <laughs> I guess you just pump, like, money into it, and then, but then what? I don't know. I don't know. I'm gonna keep doing more shields over here. I seem to always die because of shields. And if they have shields, then the armor, armor towers can't do anything. Because they suck at shields. In, in theory, if that's how we're setting them up. Alright, those are all shields. I don't, I don't know what this guy is. Why is that even there? That's a terrible place. Let's do... Two more there for shields. Yeah, for single target ballistas, I think so for sure. Especially when you're doing... Um, the challenge like this, because we're taking all of the upgrade cards just for ballistas. So all their base... Damage is already going to be multiplied by so much. Universities. See, I, I've tried using them before, but it's like you put money into them and then you have a chance to unlock upgrades, but then I never see the upgrades actually happen. And you don't get the occult things until so much later anyway. So it's like by the time you have them, it just, I don't know. I don't know. I mean, I'll try it out. I'll throw one down. See, right here, mana bolts. So now they they consume mana, but we gain plus four base damage. Although we don't have anything producing mana. We didn't take anything. Here's a siphon. <laughs> so if I take this right now, it's just going to make our towers not be able to shoot. <laughs> I would really like to take it, though, but we can't. I don't think we'd survive this wave. I'm going to go for siphon now. And then later we can do the mana bolts. All right, I want to drop some more armor towers. The thing is, like, you should still upgrade the ballistas, I think. At least a little bit, because it's so cheap. Like, a new one is going to cost us 650, but we can upgrade one of these to level 10 for, like, nothing. You know? In theory. Ooh, we got zombie Yugi already. Slow it down. Two times speed. I do like them when they're upgraded, because they shoot all three colors kind of neat. <laughs> Alright, we got we got to keep an eye on it if shielded things are getting through. Alright, I mean, I think that's handling pretty well. Yeah, but if I set if I set the shield towers to more most armor as the secondary thing, then they'll attack things with armor over things with health. And then we have towers specifically for armor. Right? Do we want that? I mean that, that seems inefficient to me. Since these these guys are better at doing health anyway. So we could do most shield most health. But then they're going to ignore things that have um, more health than shields. You know what I mean? <laughs> so, like, if something has one bar of shields and something has, like, seven bars of health, they're going to attack the thing with seven bars of health. Right? Isn't that how the, how the priorities work? Bleeding enemies take an extra plus one health from all attacks. That sounds good. Or do we go for the mana bank so we can do that other thing? No, nah, I think we just keep upgrading. No, they can't swap places. Shield is always ahead of armor, which is always ahead of health. So that's why I'm doing the shield ones first. Why is anything better than progress?
I'm just worried about the towers not attacking things that have shields. I want shields gone by the time we get it, by the time they leave this area. That's my that's my only concern. You know? I don't know. I don't know, man. <laughs> Did we upgrade the new ones? Yeah, see, these are already leveling on their own, so it's pretty It's pretty nice. There you go. That's a new one. What else was a new one? There you go. This was armor? Why does that have seven? Did I upgrade this to shield by accident? I think I did. Gone. Waste of money. <laughs> Most armor... Yeah, so these should all have... Okay. I upgraded that one to... No, no, 12 is... 12 is the default, right? Yeah, it is. Okay. <laughs> we are severely lacking in armor multipliers as, like, card upgrades for some reason. Okay, so these are all upgraded to at least level 10. That's going to be my baseline. Upgrade everything to 10. Yeah, but the robots should die once they get over here. Because otherwise... I mean, we have a long line. I could add some more, like, backup shield things in here, just in case. But what do you mean overkilling things? You mean, like, waste damage? I mean, they gotta be hit eventually by something. I mean, I'll do, I'll do most health, but if I see them not attacking, uh, shielded people, then we're, I'm, I'm changing that back. We'll try it out. There you go. Those are all most health, most shield. Because the robots, once they get over here, they should die. I think. Without a problem. And then everything else can get cleaned up behind. Let's do most armor here. Alright. And did we upgrade these at all? Maybe we should do... Because by, by, by the area back here, they should, they should only have health left. We're out of money. Okay. <laughs> Nobody answered if the the volume was good. Or should I make the music louder? Is it fine? Okay. All right. All right. That worked out. <laughs> I mean, I guess they're still targeting people with shields first, so that was a, that was fine. It's just okay. Okay, in which direction? So it's too loud or it's too quiet. <laughs> are we gonna? Are we doing mana bolts? Do we? Do we dare and do that right now? I feel like bleeding plus five percent crit chance is pretty nice though. So maybe we'll just do that. I'm just gonna send the next way. Yeah, but they'll they'll have it because. 
that's why I was, I mean, that's why I didn't mind having it on progress, because in theory, they'll still attack everything as they pass through. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Ali. <laughs> I didn't make it in time. My doorbell's buzzing. Hold on. I'm good, Edward. Somebody's coming up to my door right now, so I'm I'm gonna have to send the next wave and come back. I know I know the DOT should take effect, but I mean it, it. Everything is getting hit as they pass through, you know. So it's like something's got to get hit. <laughs> I don't know. I mean, maybe maybe I'm wrong. Burning enemies take extra armor damage. Or mana bank. No, more damage? I'm going to take the mana bank. Just so when, when we take the mana upgrade, I want to be ready. It's too loud? Okay. There we go. That should be better. I'm going to drop a couple of... We got a lot of money. So I want, I want to build up this back area, I think. A little bit. Like that, maybe? And we're going to send it. Right, so in theory, I mean, if you have only progress set, then as they pass through, everyone should get hit at least once, you know? Thanks, some dude. <laughs> Who wished me good luck today? I don't know, some dude. <laughs> Looks like we're starting to get overwhelmed a little bit. Uh oh. Oh boy. Okay. Panic purchase time? Maybe? <laughs> no, it's okay. We, we worked out. These. Let's upgrade these to health. Still got a ton of money. That's all we got. It gives bonus range and bonus base damage. So like this one has 15 base damage, which is three higher than normally would be. And it gives you more range. The base damage, not the multiplier.
All right. Sorry about that. My groceries just got delivered. <laughs> uh, what do we got here? More poison. How did that? How did that wave do? Do we? Do they make it far at all? Yeah, I modded to get uh the speed bonus or it's time bonus, whatever. Because otherwise it's just so long. <laughs> Especially like playing it is fine, but if you're like streaming it at all, it's just uh, I don't know. It's it's borderline painful. So I think I'm just gonna keep stacking more more shields for now. Most shield, most health, right? Because I think the most health was... I think that's working out. Especially, like, because they're early. Okay. And then throw down a couple more armor towers. We can't see once they get expensive enough. It's 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 a little uh, <laughs> it's a little tough. Most armor, most health, also I guess. Once you can't once you can't just start affording like tons of towers, I feel like you got to start dropping them. Or I mean, uh, dropping them, upgrading them. The only problem with doing this is that the little fast guys get by, like, really easily. Okay. It's, uh, 6 o'clock here. PM. Sorry, I'm just changing the uh, volume for myself. I changed it in OBS. Uh, so it should be the same volume for you guys, but louder for me, I believe. That's true, I could do some fastest. That might That might be good. Yeah, the, prob the problem is if I, I mean, if I mix it up, it would be nice, but I just, the whole point of this area in front is to get rid of their shields and then get rid of their armor. Because otherwise you just have, like, this whole, like, disorganized mess. I feel like. I could be wrong. Again, I, I could be completely wrong. Uh, More poison? I don't think we have it yet, right? Right, we don't. Okay, so now now we have one in each. Oh, we have two in bleed. Okay. So let's do... I could do a couple of towers, like, over here, just to get them started. A little bit. I don't know if that's a good plan. Overkill, maybe. Yeah, but 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 how do you control it? What what other way do you do it? I mean, overkill only matters once you get past the initial part, because these towers. So in my mind, these towers are only here to do shields. If they also kill things, then great. But if they don't, like what? It doesn't matter, because they're just here to wipe the shields, and then these ones are here to wipe the armor, and then the rest of the towers should be finishing them off. So overkill might be an issue on these ones. That's true. All right, so why don't we put... Let's put... I'll put a few towers that are, like, fastest. Like there. And I'll try and rem I'll try and remember. <laughs> But then what do you mark them? What do you... I'll just leave them. They can level up on their own. Am 
Like that? These ballistas are just getting so expensive. They're almost a grand each now. <laughs> Armor's starting to be a problem, huh? Or are they attacking things with more health? More range? Or more armor? Uh choices. Probably more range. Because that benefits all of them. I'm just arbitrarily choosing to take them up to level 10. I don't know what the best, like, amount to spend on each is. I mean, each one we're spending a grand on it, and then we're upgrading only, like, a couple hundred more. So we could upgrade them even more than that to get the most out of each tower, in theory. Those are all the ones that we bought, right? Not enough gold already. Alright. This one's coming back around. <laughs> is, is speed 3 too fast? Should we slow it down? I don't know if you guys want to be here for like three hours. That's the only problem. <laughs> I mean, I think it's working well. No? The problem is, I don't know. I mean, it works well every other time I try it. And then you get to the end game and it's just, there's just all these things, you know? Like, I feel like it's really easy to get far, but then, like, making it past that is the problem. Poison enemy slow. Ooh. Or more range. See, that's... that's tough. Five fifty gold it costs? Yeah, see that? I mean, when we're, when we're spending, you know, a grand per tower, that doesn't seem like it's not worth the investment, I think. Right? I think we're going to go... I want to slow them more? No, more range. I want more range. Screw it. I think the fastest towers is kind of working nice because they're slowing them down. Slow, like you want me to slow it down? Like that? Or you were saying I should have taken the slow card. <laughs> Plus, also, if they're all set to most shields, I mean, it, it doesn't necessarily overkill since as soon as something else with more shields come around, it gives more, it starts targeting other things. So, it, like, it switches on its own, in theory. More range? Holy shit. How much range does it give? I don't think I've ever gotten that many upgrades for range. Should I try the university? Someone said I should do the university. It goes next to these things, right? See, so... 
What do you do? You just, like, pay money into it? I mean, I've done that before. And it seems to not really, uh... Do you have to level... level ah, do you have to level it up all the way? Like, what is the discovery chance? Is that per turn? Per... Le or per level or whatever, or what? Put three down? What, like that? Three percent? Oh, three universities down. Around the same thing? Like that? Yeah, I've spent the money before. Per turn. Okay, so it's per turn. So I'll just do... I guess I should focus them, huh? I'm just gonna waste a bunch of money. Don't worry about it. <laughs> okay, so this one will be just health. We'll put some in there for like 10%. That one will be armor. 10%. And that one will be... Shields, 10%? 15%? 15%. Okay. Yeah, okay. So yeah, I just did that. So this is health 15, that's armor 15, and that's magic 15. Should I do more? I could afford to do more. I'm just a little worried. Oh, shit. Look at that range, huh? That's set to fast. Maybe I'll do another fastest one over here, because it can reach all the way to there now. Ah, that's long range. I don't think I've ever gotten that many upgrades for that. Fastest. Not enough gold. Oh, I could just drop more universities. But it's 15% per university. They don't stack, right? Or is it global? The bonuses are global. So if I do more universities, it would be 15 each. Like each one has a 15% chance, right? All right. Did I cough into the mic? <laughs> the cough. <laughs> yeah, I have a, uh, I have a lot of like throat stuff. Just always, it's very frustrating, especially for like recording. I don't know. I don't. I don't know how to deal with it. I did. All right, I'm gonna check after. Nice. Okay, all right, that's fine. So that's simpler than I thought. I just didn't, I don't know. I should have looked it up. I never look things up in games like this. I just like figuring it out. It's like more fun. This is going to be a pain in the ass. <laughs> like, ass just waiting for them to come. Fifteen percent crit chance again? Didn't we already take that? Oh, forty-four <laughs> percent crit chance. Nice. That's the way to do it. You're right. We did global health damage. Okay. All right. All right. Fine. Fine. I'll do more universities. You convinced me. But if I lose, it's going to be because of these. I've decided. This is turning around really nicely, actually. My... my... Minor concern is, uh, 
these towers, hitting hitting armor things constantly and stuff like that, and leveling those stats up over shields. So maybe I should I should pump a few 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 gold into them. I don't know, man. I'm starting to feel good about this. I think we can do it. I think we got this. <laughs> we already got Oogie. He's right here. And he's already got 20,000 uh, stacks on him of everything. <laughs> 30? No, no, still 20. Mid-20s. And he got froze. Oh, I guess that's the frozen thing. We have a 3% chance to freeze? Ooh, look at that. He can barely move. Yeah. I'm loving that. I'm loving that for me. All universities get plus 3% bonus. Ooh. Ooh. That's all right. It's it's my fault for hiding the UI. Cause it cause it looks nicer that way. It's possible, man. But universities are expensive, in game or in life. <laughs> so what is it? To, wait. So we gained three. So so it should be at eighteen. Okay. So this one was armor eighteen. There you go. This is health. Yeah. Okay. All right, I'm not going to do more than this, though. Whoops, I went too far. How do I... Guys, guys, I can't click on the chest. <laughs> it can't. It's behind the tower. Can you... Ro oh, you can rotate? No, that's not a rotate. Can you rotate? I don't think you can rotate. How do I get... How do I get the chest? I can't get it. <laughs> I can't get it. All right. Oh, man, but it's level 14. Okay. Mana Bolt. Ooh. It's time. It's time to cry. Poisoning slows them. Good. Extra savings. Okay. All right. All right, now we need, like, all the mana siphons in the world. Because I'm about to cry, cry, cry. I hope it's going to be enough. Because otherwise we're in trouble. Hopefully this doesn't kill the uh, the achievement. I don't imagine it would. I mean, it's not one of the towers. It's literally in a separate menu section. So it shouldn't. Right? And some universities, maybe? No! Shit. I guess I don't lose money. That's fine. I meant Man and Bank. Okay. Is that fine? I think that's fine. What is that? Oh, that guy's doing fastest. He's already level 7. That's nice. And this is... Sure. Let's plunk a little cash. Plunk a little cash to upgrade my shields. Okay. Alright, shields are going to be a big deal now, right? Because these guys are all the ghosty dudes. So I think we got to worry about shields. How's our mana? Mana's holding. Sort of. I mean, it's like it's like bursting downward. <laughs> That's <laughs> I'm a little worried, man. But I think it'll be okay. Too late for what, Andis? I think those range upgrades were the key here. 
Because we got the armor, armor ones hitting like all the way to here. Like, look at that. Mana bolts too? Ooh, do we just keep going? Plus four more base damage? Yeah. <laughs> of course. <laughs> Why not? How's this? See, look, it's only we've only gotten that one upgrade. Oh, wait. No, it's per... Oh, it doesn't show you... Can you see the overall gold-like thing? Oh, yeah. I mean, I guess, yeah, you're right. It is too late. Because we had put the universities down already. <laughs> Does it show in the stats? No. Oh, it shows up here, top right. Plus one, so we've gotten four or five, five upgrades total. Okay. Yeah, I see it. It's right here. Yeah. All right. Uh, I guess I should just expand. See where we need more. This turnaround is amazing. I think this is a winner. I don't think I'm even gonna gonna spend money next turn. I'm just gonna send it. <laughs> More range? That's insane. That's crazy. Wow. <laughs> That's nuts. This one's almost reaching over here. This one's going to end here, right? Yeah, that's I mean that's what I figured, right? I was just curious if I should have pushed this further or not first. Yes, it is. It's just like it's so much. That's why I, I mean this game this game is like visual candy, you know? More so than like I mean it's still a tower game, but I don't know. Between the music and just all the all the colorful stuff that's happening, it's great. Oh, we're getting little ghosty dudes getting through. That's bad. That's bad. I don't like this. I don't think it'll reach there. Oh, it almost reaches. Wow. Yeah, the spawning guys are a problem. Yeah, right here. Yeah, I want. Yeah, that 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 one's gonna be gigantic. Okay. Oh, I should have been looking at my mana. I'm not sure where our mana stands right now. Maybe that's why we weren't doing so well. Because <laughs> we did we run out of mana. No, we didn't. We still got it. Uh, okay. More armor damage? This one's shields. Have we not been taking that? I thought we were. Alright, we got 20 grand to play with. So. Ooh. What should that one be? Most health. There you go. That one, too. Let's do least health. Because they got to make it all the way around anyway. I'm not even sure if that's a good idea or not. <laughs> all right, we definitely need 
We need something. Do we just need more towers in general? Like... I'll just space them out a bit. I guess that's not good. Okay. And then what? Just keep stacking them. I think last time I started upgrading too many. Instead of just putting more down. So maybe I should put more down. Alright. Screw it. <laughs> Strategy be damned. Overkill sometimes will work. No, our mana is disappearing. Oh, that's why. That's why they were getting through. Oh, we're out of mana. It was, it was the mana. It was the mana. That was the problem. <laughs> okay. I think, I think we're on top of it now. Whew. Okay. Research, but more crit? Oh, dude. Gotta take that, right? Yeah. Oh, yeah, you're right. I think that's all, right? Because it can't, can't place it there. Yeah. That's all it is. I should really just place ballistas on all the black things and just let them, let them shoot at whatever they want. <laughs> I believe that we can force this line to go all the way to here if we're lucky. Ah, but it ended. Weak. Yeah, I feel like crit's definitely the way to go. Like this tower. Oh, that. Wait, why is that? Oh, because we just bought that. Like that one has fifty percent crit right now. Oh, no, it's more than that. Times two times three. So there's different levels of crit? Mana's doing fine now. We're okay. We're okay. Oh, man. Maybe we're not okay. I don't know. I don't know what we are. to think right now it's those damn summoning guys they're 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 the ones that really get us i think i need more i don't know what i need more of what's up stone okay More poison per second will give them. Will get rid of this shields faster. Yeah, they are. It's the summoning guys. I mean, we're ripping. We're stripping them pretty well over here. But I feel like maybe we need like a middle area here just for like most health or something. 
Maybe these towers will be most help. Okay. Near death for the portals? Why so few? It's a lot. I mean, they're expensive. They're up to a grand each now. <laughs> so near the portals here? If I make them near death, then they'll... How about I make... Like that? Like, plus fives all around near death. Is near death... I guess near death is better than least health, right? Anytime, Sticky. <laughs> sticky Addis. It's a one letter off from being uh, inappropriate. <laughs> After the shield one. Oh, like here. Oh, okay, I got you. Okay. So like that? Like we'll do those near death? So what should these random ones be then? Least health? Or does near death still work? I think that still works. That should pick off the little ones. Alright, we're, we're out of money. Uh, I'm worried this is the end. <laughs> so these should be... Those are most health. So I'll upgrade them a little. That's all I got. I think we're okay on mana. No? Oh no, we're not. There's just too much burst. But I just bought so many mana banks. Here, we'll do more mana banks. We don't have, have money. Yeah, man, mana's holding up all right. We have we have six percent mana regen, and one percent on kill. It's the spawning dudes that, like, really knock everything down. Ugh, we're only, like, a few levels away, too. This is gonna get real painful. Real quick. <laughs> Mana's holding. Mana's fine. All right. Ugh, these damn portals. We should do maybe like near deaths like over here. Like earlier too. To finish these guys off. Because they're making it too far. Oh, imagine taking another mana bolt. <laughs> Plus four more base damage. Oh, that's tempting, but I don't think we can handle it. I'll just do the poisoned enemies, I guess. You guys tell me, what do you vote for? More mana bolts or poisoned enemies take one plus shield? 
What, putting them like earlier on? I put them like in the middle, but I guess earlier on is it would be better. Yeah. I'm just going to poison enemies. I can't. Yeah, I'm too scared. I'm just afraid. <laughs> uh, So we can do that one near death. Can do... Still want to get some bonuses here. This one's okay, probably. Yeah, that's fine. Near death. Can that reach? That can reach. Not ideal. Oh, there you go. Near death. Near death. You were outvoted, Jackson. <laughs> How long of a delay is there between in this chat? I assume that it's like Twitch and it's fairly instant, but it seems like there's a bit of a delay. So I need to wait longer before I do things. <laughs> uh, I guess I should spend a little to upgrade these like that. That was near death also. All right. Near deaths get an upgrade to health, right? I think that makes the most sense. What else was near death? I don't remember anymore. Whatever. Let's do one there. Near death. Uh, Broke. We're broke. <laughs> We're broke again. Alright. Level 41. Okay, next level's coming up. I mean, I could sell some of these, like, towers that are scattered around. I didn't put any money into them. They're already leveled up, though. Now nah, I'm gonna leave them. They're probably doing something. I like, I like them just shooting and the mana just shooting way down because they're all like in sync with each other. <laughs> just like a massive burst. Yeah, I don't know, man. This, feel, this feels like the, the runs I've tried before and failed because you just get so much... Yeah. Yeah, there's only two more. Yeah, probably. Psychological damage? Yeah, there is psycho blah, psychological damage. But it's directed at me. I'm the one taking it. <laughs> Emotional damage? Yeah. Your dad never loved you, monster. <laughs> it is working. I think adding the near-death things really really was a big deal. I should do more of those. Okay. Are we really going to get an upgrade for nothing? We got, we got a none upgrade. I'll do scholarships, I guess. I could do the mine, but it's almost no point. If they get through, I have so many banditry things that they're just gonna... It won't matter. <laughs> you know? Oh, there's still one up top. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Okay. I could do early near deaths, like over here. That could work, too. All right, screw it. Near death. Upgrade to 10. Near death. Upgrade to 10. Near death. Upgrade to 10. Okay. Are these upgraded at all? Yeah, they're all level 10. No, they're not. Some of them are. And level these up. Okay. Oh, 
Okay. Some of these should be, like, near death, probably. Like, a couple random ones. There you go. Near death. Should probably have some fastest ones, too, right? I think that's almost health. Maybe I'll make some of these fastest. Ooh. I should put some over here and make them slowest because then they'll hit the portals, right? Because the portals are by far the slowest thing. I got no room. I want all I want the bonuses. <laughs> Here. Slowest. No money. We're out of money. Okay. Probably another mana bank just in case. I have some empty mountains, yeah. I mean over here is I just if they're if they're getting over here, we're already in trouble. That's my thought process. So we need we need them sorted out over here. We, it's the portals that are a problem. The portals need to be dealt with before they get too far. Because then they just keep spawning more and more things. I think. Alright. Mana's holding. If it holds in the beginning of the stage, it'll probably hold for the rest. God, it's just... Look at this. It's beautiful. <laughs> and that's only one tower type. Oh, we might make it. Come on. We can do this. We can do this. Oh. It's just there's too many of them for the ballistas to handle. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> uh, I'm scared. Are these guys getting hit? They are getting hit. What is that tower? Near death. Okay. Oh, <laughs> more crit chance. Oh, my God. Yes. Yes, more crit chance. What the hell are they up to now? 50%. 50% well, for times two and 4% for times three. So does it spill over? Does it max out at 50% and then it starts going to the next one? Is that how that works? 50 and then 8. Yeah, I think that's how. I mean, I wouldn't say it's not even close. They were pretty close. Because these towers aren't as strong. We got 12 grand to play with. I feel like the portals are still the problem. So I'm going to keep doing near death. I hope this is a good, good, good move. She could cover every, everything possible. We only have two more levels. It's 45 is the end, right? I think 45 is the last one. Uh, I'm worried. Okay. That one's just going to be progress. Okay. Slowest? Yeah, we. I think we already have a few slowest. 
Yeah, slowest. We did, we did some slowest ones last time. Should I switch more over to slowest? I could. That's slowest. 45 is big brain? Okay. That's fastest. Maybe that doesn't need to be fastest. That could be slowest. Yeah. That's fastest also. Slowest. <laughs> I don't care about the fastest anymore. I wish there was a way to like see what things are set to. <laughs> that would be nice. Push forward? Well, it's too late now. But I feel like this is our this is like our killing field here, you know? So I feel like you gotta stack it up. Maybe not. Maybe I'm wrong. And it'll be my doom. Oh, that mana chunk at, st at the start. <laughs> yeah, that looks cool. <laughs> Arise! Arise, Colossus! Arise! It's just, it's just all like weird micro priority stuff in order to win with ballistas, I feel like. All right, the, the spawners aren't making it very far. So I think we got it, we got it pretty good over here. Maybe, I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, mana's holding. If it holds at the start, then it holds throughout. Because that we we use by far the most at the very start of the match. Oh, this is easy. I mean, <laughs> famous last words, right? Okay. Oh, that's a good one. Crit steal 10% of the current poison as, as extra poison damage. They have stacks of like thousands of poison. Right? Yeah, that's the one to go for. That's the one. This is it. Last level. 12 grand. 12 grand. I don't know, man. That last level, there's so many portals. Like so many. All right, uh, I'm going to do like a whole thing here just on slowest because that should target the portals. And I'm not I'm not going to upgrade them. That's true. You're right. Once they get past things, I can sell them. I could probably even sell the universities right at the start. Because they're useless once once the mission starts. I feel like I just need more stuff over here, too. Maybe like that. This I'll make fastest. Because why not? Oh, that's a terrible placement. Uh, 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 uh just more in the middle? more towers in the middle. Okay. Slowest. 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 I already have those. See, these are all these are all towers. Unless you mean like I should sell them. All the level threes are more, unless you mean like, I guess there's two more. Those are just in a terrible location. All level threes, like the mountains. Hmm. I mean, we have the level fours or level fives, whatever the hell the black tower is. I mean, this is it. Once, once I start, there's no more. <laughs> So give me, give me, give me suggestions now. 
Give me suggestions now. <laughs> Otherwise, we're screwed. Could do more mana just in case. Those are cheap enough. All right. I'm not seeing any suggestions come in, so we're, we're just doing this. We're going. I guess I could upgrade some things. What is that? Slowest? You get health upgrade. Near death? Health. Hell, okay, that's it. They're not all in slowest. Some of them are slowest, and some are... Uh, or, I mean, the, the early ones are slowest. Because I just want them hitting the... Uh, put some fastest in the back. Yeah, but I want them targeting the portals. The portals are the things that are spawning everything else. The portal enemies. So I want them I want them to to die. Fastest in the back. I think we have fastest over here. Fastest? Yeah, we have some fastest. I mean, these a lot of these will catch the the rockets mostly cuz they're they're fast. So they'll they'll be ahead of everything else, right? These are all set to near death. Because I figure that should be the same thing as fastest or least health, right? Early on. That one's set to nothing. What is this guy doing? Fastest. Yeah, there's, there's early... That's progress. That shouldn't be progress. Fastest. That's slowest. That might be okay. That's not good. Slowest. Cause slow I want them killing the portal enemies, right? I mean that's that seems to be the big issue. I don't know, I guess I should just start. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, yeah. Alright, alright. I'm gonna I'm gonna go speed one. No fast speed. So we whoa, okay. Look at them destroy Brain Oogie. Oh, <laughs> holy shit. Yes. <laughs> oh, wait, I can sell the universities, right? Just drop, I don't know, some random towers throughout. There you go, whatever. <laughs> I'm not worried about the robots. I'm worried about the portal dudes. I think they're they're the big problem. The portal dudes and the spawny dudes. Like, this portal guy's getting through. No, he's not. Okay, we got him. I think we got this. I think it's in the bag. Oh, uh, his little dudes are getting through, but I, I think we, we got enough towers over there to handle them. So long as portals don't make it through, we'll be okay. Mana, mana's actually hurting a little bit. <laughs> I think it's all right though. No, let's let's drop some more uh, mana banks. I guess I can put them anywhere. Don't want to miss the action. Mana's still going down. Okay, that's all the money we got. Where's the big brain? Big Brain's all the way back here. His shield's gone, but he's still got armor. But he's poisoned and, and uh, on fire and everything and bleeding. So he I don't think he's going to regenerate. I think it's in the bag, guys. Yeah, 
First try. First try on stream. Yes. <laughs> I did try this challenge like three times already. Off stream and failed. So I think I just needed a, I need, I need a, I need a group, group effort. Big brain Oogie's going down. What does he got? See, he has a hundred thousand burn and, uh, and bleed. A <laughs> hundred thousand. I can't tell how much poison he has. It's hiding underneath. Not just me, not well done, dude. Well done, us. <laughs> I don't think I would have done it on my own. Streamer luck? <laughs> maybe, maybe. I I should stream uh, Elden Ring then, because I'm terrible at that game. <laughs> oh. Only Ballista, I got it. You guys can't see the, the achievement, but I got the achievement. Nice. Woohoo! <laughs> <laughs> that was great. That was great. We spent 135,000 gold on ballistas. <laughs> the damage the DOTs did almost as much damage as the actual ballistas themselves. You see that? I don't know. I can't I can't zoom that screen. 32 million damage ballistas and 20 almost 25 million damage over time yes victory <laughs> all right yeah the houses see i mean over the course of that entire game they they i mean seven percent still nice i guess it's worth it i guess that they're worth it because each ballista was what like a grand something Two, three, four, five, six. We had like seven, eight, nine, ten. We had ten. We had ten ballistas attached to houses. And each one costs 1400 now. So I don't know. I guess they kind of pay for themselves almost. I'm not sure. All right. That's going to be it for me, guys. Uh, I gotta go put my groceries away and stuff. <laughs> uh, and I gotta edit the next video. So, uh, this was fun. This was fun. It was worked out. Maybe, I'm not sure. I'm not sure what the next challenge should be. You guys can, uh, maybe you can vote. I tried doing a, uh, a monolith one. And, uh, I failed miserably. <laughs> I don't know. Thank you. Congratulations to all of us. Does this? Yeah, Elden Ring is hard, man. It's hard. And I've played all the Demon Souls games and everything, but Elden Ring specifically is only Shredders. I can't do Shredders. I hate Shredders. They sound awful. <laughs> I can't, uh... I don't know. The gear, gear, gear. Like, especially when you have multiple of them. Mines only? That might be interesting. I don't even think I've ever used the Mines Tower. You'd watch me do it? Yeah. I I, I was welcoming it. I, that's what I figured was going to happen. I didn't actually expect to win. I figured we'd have to try a few times. I have almost everything unlocked. I don't have anything unlocked for Mines. Where are they? I'm not, could you win with just mines? Like, mines with ballistas or just mines? The ice, yeah, the ice cream might have melted. Here, let's just, let's just unlock everything. I have enough experience, I think. There we go. What else? Yeah, let's just ruin all my possible upgrades in the future. <laughs> there we go. Particle cannon. Do I get an achievement for uh, unlocking everything? Okay. And the lookout. 
Oh, I ran out. <laughs> Just mines is harder. Fire only. I I mean like I said I tried to I tried to do uh I tried to do obelisk or my, my yeah. I tried to do obelisk but obelisk no uh no ballistas. And uh they're just like it's hard cuz they're single target and the mana requirements insane. So I just I don't know. I don't know. It might be possible. <laughs> it might be possible. Anyway, I'm going to get off. Uh love you guys. Thanks for uh thanks for tuning in. Maybe I'll hop on and do this again. This is a good game to to do this with cuz it's uh it's interactive. <laughs> it's interactive, you know? Tesla's too easy. Tesla's like Tesla's the easy one cuz it's it's an AoE tower. So you're just throwing it down and like hitting everything. It it feels to me it feels too easy. I don't know. All right. Later, guys. Yeah, poison and fire. You could do poison and fire, like, together. I don't know. We'll figure something out. I'll do it again. This was pretty fun. <laughs> and more successful than Battle Brothers. Although I did play that the other day, and I did pretty well. So I don't, I don't know. I don't know. I think I was just having the opposite of streamer luck, whatever that is. <laughs> All right. Goodbye for real. Hello. Hello, Roadbreaker. <laughs> Thank you. I am the Roadbreaker. But I am signing off, Holmes. Sorry, Holmes, Holmes. Watson. Is there a Watson in the crowd? Hello? All right.